Hey everyone, so welcome back to my channel. I'm gonna start off by prepping my model's eyes for the eye makeup. I'm using the LA Girl Pro HD Concealer in the shade Medium to apply that all over her eyelid as a base. I'm using a dense concealer brush to blend out the product. Then I'm gonna take this Inglot Rainbow Refill to fill in her eyebrows. So I'm just using short strokes to fill in her eyebrows. Then I'm gonna clean up underneath her eyebrow for that lift. I'm using the same LA Girl concealer in the shade medium beige. Again going in with the same concealer brush to blend out the product. Then I'm gonna take this PAC contour powder in the shade 18 and I'm gonna put that as a crease color onto her crease using a windshield wiper motion and using a fluffy uh, crease brush. Then I'm gonna take this pink eyeshadow from PAC again and I'm gonna put that onto the crease as well using a different blending brush. Then I'm gonna mix two eyeshadows from MAC, Woodwinked and Amber Lights and I'm gonna use this as her all over eyelid color and I'm using a synthetic brush to apply the shimmer eyeshadows. Then I'm gonna take Sumptuous Olive again from MAC and I'm gonna put that to the outer corners of her eyes. Her dress has a green in it so I'm using this as a pop of color onto the eyelids. Then I'm gonna mix this blue eyeshadow from Lacme and a black uh, matte eyeshadow from Inglot and I'm gonna put that right at the end of her eyelid at the outer V. Once I have applied, I'm gonna go in with another brush to blend out any harsh lines. Then to highlight her brow bone and the inner corners of her eyes, I'm using the Balm Mary Luminizer Highlighter. To line her eyes, I'm using the Maybelline Gel Eyeliner in black. And I'm gonna create a winged eyeliner starting from the middle of her upper lash line. Then I'm coating her eyelashes with the Maybelline Colossal Mascara. After that, I'm going to clean out any eyeshadow fallout using a wet wipe from her face. To prime her face, I'm using the Benefit Professional Primer. So I'm just going to dot it on her face and blend it out using my fingertips. Then I'm going to add this face's Metallic Glow uh, Liquid in the shade Champagne to add a beautiful sheen to her face. For foundation, I'm mixing two shades from MAC Studio Fix Fluid and I'm using NC37 and NC42. I'm using a flat foundation brush to apply the foundation all over her face. I'm going in with my Real Techniques Miracle Sponge to blend out uh, further. To highlight her face, I'm using the same LA Girl Concealer in Medium Beige. And I'm gonna draw a few stripes underneath her eyes, on her forehead, on the bridge of her nose, on the cupid's bow, chin and also under her contour line. I'm using another shade from LA Girl in the shade Beautiful Bronze to contour her face. I'm applying that underneath her cheekbones, on the sides of her nose, on her forehead, under the lips and also under the jawline. Then I'm going to take this Real Techniques contour brush and I'm going to blend out the highlighted areas first. Then
Then I'm gonna clean off my brush onto a tissue and I'm gonna use the same brush to blend out the contour. I'm gonna use a smaller brush to blend out her nose contour. To set her face, I'm using MAC Studio Fix Powder in NC35 and 42 mixed together. I'm using a fluffy powder brush to set her face. Before setting her under eyes, I'm going to take off any crease that might have formed under the eyes using a concealer brush. And I'm going to bake under the eyes using the Kryolan Derma Color Fixing uh, Powder. Doing the same thing on the other eye. Also, I'm gonna bake on her forehead and the bridge of her nose. Moving back to the eyes, I'm using the Plum Nature Studio Kajal in Black to line her lower water lines. This is a really long lasting and waterproof Kajal. Then I'm taking this matte black eyeshadow from Inglot again. I'm going to put that at the very edge of her lower lash line. Then I'm taking the blue eyeshadow from Lacme and I'm going to put that on the rest of the lower lash line. This is going to give a pop to the eyes as well. Once that is done, I'm gonna take the PAC contour powder and blend out her lower lash line and smoke it out. Dusting off the excess powder using the same fluffy powder brush. Coating her lashes with the same uh, Maybelline Colossal Mascara on the lower lashes. Then to set, to set her liquid uh, contour, I'm using the Makeup Revolution Ultra Contour Palette. Mixing a few shades and setting all the cream contour areas. Again using a smaller brush for her nose contour. To add a bit of a glow to her face, I'm using the Balm Mary Luminizer to the tops of her cheekbones, on the bridge of her nose, on her cupid's bow and the chin. To add a flush of color to her cheeks, I'm applying MAC Fleur Power Blush to the apples of her cheeks. I applied some falsies off camera. These are the PAC Eyelashes number 59. To line her lips, I'm using the Rimmel Exaggerate Lip Liner in the shade Obsession. This is a beautiful reddish uh, brown shade and it's universally flattering on all skin tones so I'm just using that to line her lips. For lipstick I'm taking MAC Cross Wires Lipstick. This is a beautiful corally pink shade applying that on her entire lips. Topping it off using a Faces Canada Go Chic Lip Gloss in the shade Candy Eyes to the center of her lips to give that plumped effect. So that is the finished uh, makeup look. I hope you enjoyed watching this client makeup tutorial. If you liked it, please do give it a thumbs up for more client makeup tutorials from me and don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. I will see you all soon in my next video. Bye.